Hello, Zany friends. I am Lainey. I am Marshall. And today we're going to talk about Kind of Famous by Marianne Marlowe. Marianne Marlowe is an author I discovered last year. I read another one of her books and she did contact me and say, hey, do you want the rest of my books to review? And I said, yes, of course. And so I totally have to apologize because I am so behind on reading <laughs> what she gave me. It's not even funny. I thought I would have more time to read books with the, what was going on right now with the quarantine, but I don't know what happened. But I did read this one, which is the one that just came out. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna read this one right now because if I don't, she's gonna kill me. <laughs> I will get to the rest, I promise, Marianne. I know you're probably gonna watch this. Kind of Famous is a story of a girl named Layla who runs a fan site for a band, The Walking Disaster, if I remember correctly. So she runs this fan site, but then she ends up getting a job at a, like kind of an online newspaper. So she is going to be like running their social media. And no one on the fan site knows that she's going to do this. And her first day on the job, she actually meets someone who is like, the sister-in-law to the lead singer of the band or the fan site she works at. Or the, that fan site she runs? You get it. Related. There she's related. And ends up in this whole community of people of not only this band, but also this other band called Theater of the Absurd, which so like there's a guy in the first band who is related to the guy in the second band. Two bands together. All right. Makes perfect sense when you're reading it in a book, okay? So she starts to fall for the drummer of this other band. He doesn't know that she runs a fan site for this, for a band that's very closely related to him. I think she just works at the paper. They fall very fast and hard. And so she's struggling to keep the secrecy of her fan site that she's trying to just keep mellow and not cause a lot of drama. But yet at the same time, keep this life where she's actually around these people that if the people in the fan site found out she was around would go ballistic <laughs> like they would go crazy stalker crazy right yeah <laughs> while working at a paper where she has the connection to these bands that she now needs to help promote in a way marshall's brain is just exploded it's not as complicated as I'm making it sound, I promise. <laughs> yeah, it's one of those things that, like, while you're reading it, you stop seeing how the characters are all related exactly, mm -hmm. and they just become the characters, so it's a little bit easier to understand. It is. But when, but when you're trying to explain how these people all came together, and this is Higgs Field Theory. The book itself was really fun. It made me think of that movie, Almost Famous, because people who come into a band's life type of story, but not as Cameron Crowe-like. I gave this book four stars because it was just such a fun read and such another great one from Marianne Marlowe. One caution though, this book has a lot of sex scenes in it. So if you are the type of person that doesn't really like a lot of sex in the book. Sex, drugs, rock and roll. That's the lifestyle. Exactly. If you weren't expecting <laughs> one of those three things here, we're going to have issues. It's not like sexy in a gross way, but it, it, there is a lot of sex scenes. I'm just telling you that. You know just so you know. But thank you so much for watching. All the information will be down below for you to purchase this book. And until next time, stay dandy. Bye-bye.